I want to do something a little different on today's episode. I want to get into something. I want to pull apart something. I want to explore an idea that requires a little bit of time to really flesh out. Is there anything you'd like to say to people out there? Follow your dreams. You can reach your goals. I'm living proof. Beefcake. I search inspirational memes and things come up like, it always seems impossible until it's done. You're only confined by the walls you build yourself. Do something today that your future self will thank you for. I think all of that's wonderful. I think it's beautiful that this is what's being shared, that positivity has become the norm. But I want to add a little color to that. I want to share my thoughts on what pursuing what chasing a dream really means. Because when the going gets tough, A tough get going! A couple of caveats here. I'm not a cynic, I'm not a negative person, but there are some truths here, some realities that coincide with pursuing a dream that are a lot less glamorous than are typically associated. Number two, all of these ideas, none of them are mine. This is nothing more than an amalgam, a collection, an aggregate of ideas that I've accumulated over life that I subscribe to and believe in. In life, you can get whatever you want, but you can't want whatever you want. That doesn't make any sense. Let me explain. If you really, if you truly are one of those people who commits a life to pursuing, to realizing a dream, you have to be a little crazy. John Balthazar says you have to be possessed. Oh, fucking die! I agree with that. If you are one of those possessed individuals, if you want it so bad, you will get it. But not all of us, not everyone wants it that bad. So when your kindergarten teacher said to you, Billy, Susie, you can get whatever you want in this world. She wasn't wrong. But those words mean very different things to different people. Here is a guaranteed way for you to realize your every dream. It's super simple. I'm gonna write it down. If you commit your entire life to a dream, you will find it. Because if you commit your everything, your entire being, there's only one of two possible outcomes. Number one, you'll find it. You will succeed. Number two, you'll die trying and it won't make a difference either way. So that is a guarantee. That is a positively a guaranteed way to get there. It's the guy who's willing to die who's going to win that itch. I'd like to reference a band called Anvil. This is a heavy metal band from the early 80s that you've definitely never heard of unless you've seen a documentary about this heavy metal band from the early 80s. They were like sort of big in the early 80s. They never exploded. They were never Metallica. But after the like brief peak of success, the lead singer of this band never gave up on the dream. He never let go of his dream to be a rock star. He refused to. And like 20 years later, the guy's living in Canada. He has a minimum wage job delivering food to school cafeterias, like a really unglamorous job. But he never let go of the dream. He would play at bars or wherever he could play his Given your reputation, you should be playing in front of a thousand people every night, and you are not. He refused to give it up to such a degree that everyone called him crazy. So crazy, so possessed, so insane, that they made a documentary about the fact that he would not give up on his dream. It's a dream, but I'm going to make it come true. Now this documentary was fantastic, a wildly successful movie. And it brought so much attention to the guy and the band that people wanted to see them play. And then he like booked a world tour where they sold out concerts around the world. He achieved the dream. He's a rock star. And he was a rock star because he re 
because he committed his entire life to it. Everything committed to it. And in the end, he's like 60 years old. He got it. And that is a great segue to my next point, which is that to commit to this, to commit everything to chasing that dream, it may guarantee you'll find that it does not guarantee a happy or great life. It may mean a life where you're delivering food to school cafeterias for minimum wage and having everyone who loves and cares about you telling you you're crazy. That can be the path. 20, 30 years of that can be the path to pursuing a dream. And that part of the pursuit, that is not a part of the pursuit that people like to talk about. There are no memes about that part of the pursuit. So where does this, where does this all go? Ugh. What is my conclusion on all of this? It goes like this. Dreams are important. Having goals, ambition, these are the things that drive life. But in my humble opinion, there's only one determination, there's only one factor that makes you a success or does not make you a success. It's a binary. And that is, are you happy? Are you happy with the life that you live? And if you're one of those possessed, crazy individuals that is only happy in the pursuit of that dream, then that is what you do. By the way, if you're one of those people, you don't need to be watching this because you already know all of this. But for everyone else, for all the civilians, for all the people who might not consider themselves possessed, dreams matter, goals matter. And what they do is they serve as this guiding light that steers you through life. You keep your eyes fixed on that and life may take you in all of these crazy trajectories and along the way, you'll find what makes you happy. That pursuit may lead you to a place you could have never imagined, but a place where you're very, very happy. Don't let your dreams be dreams. And that's it. That's my sort of, that is my thesis on the whole thing. There is life, there is dreams, there are happiness, and then there are crazy people. We all fall into one of these two buckets. Most of us fall into this bucket and that is a great bucket to be in. This is why there are a lot of really happy people out there who have jobs you've never heard of. It's because no matter what pursuit you choose, happiness, it is happiness that matters. So just do it! Make your dreams come true! Just do it!